I've got one of the newest pens from Le Bon. I mean, it's practically like fresh out of the factory. No, I mean, I actually, I've actually seen this pen. I saw it at the DC Pen Show uh, when me, me and Penboy Roy, we were hanging out and we were talking to Jerry who uh, works over at Le Bon. Really nice fella. So he's just super nice. And uh, so yeah, he was talking to us about the new pen that's in here, which is the Le Bon 986 Giloche. So as you might've guessed, a Giloche, that means that this has a nice patterning on, okay, let's just get to the pen. So check out the new box. I like this box. It's like a, it slides out like a drawer. So there's your pen. So what's also in, in here is this really cute little nifty sticker of a Le Bon Nib. I love stickers. I mean, who doesn't love stickers? They're awesome. I love stickers. I wish, I wish I had like a bunch of these, you know, so I can decorate things with it. Anyway, so before I get to the pen, you've seen it. It's in its little plastic sleeve here. Let's take this off and let's see what comes inside. So you have like what appears to be a bookmark. It's pretty cool and also have a little little desiccant packet that's cool it keeps everything nice and dry and a little Le Bon catalog and pretty much what's in here is this is the international guarantee so if anything happens to your pen especially if it's a manufacturing defect this way you can get contact Le Bon and see about getting your pen fixed or replaced so it does come in this plastic sleeve and if I can get this off here, slide that out and here you go. You are welcome for this eye candy. There's just something about the Giloche patterning that I just, I love it. And I love that it has a lot of dimension to it. And I love how it reflects light and provides kind of like this optical illusion, like a three dimensional optical illusion. I just think that's lovely. This is actually, it's a beautiful geometric pattern, which is on a solid brass body. So the barrel and the cap is brass. It has gold appointments. I love the red and gold together. I think it's, I think that's really beautiful. I think red and silver would have looked pretty cool too. So you know, there's nothing on the finial. It's just a little, it has a little conical shape. It's very subtle. It's a little clip. Oh, clip's nice. And so on the gold band here at the bottom of the cap, it says Le Bon. And that's pretty much it. But yeah, so what's going on here is over this geometric pattern, there is a red lacquer that is placed over the design. And apparently it takes several coats of lacquer to go over this. And pretty much it's a, it, the lacquer, the red lacquer is translucent. And that way it doesn't cover up all of the beautiful patterning here. And then it's covered with a clear lacquer. So the color is going to be nice and protected. Hopefully it's very resistant to scratching, which is very important. I'd hate for this to get scratched up and take away some of that beautiful red. But the one thing about this Giloche patterning, and it's, I, I really kind of like this because it's different, but you can feel the pattern. You can feel it's very tactile. So you can feel exactly what's going on under here. And I like that. I think it's so different. Sometimes, you know, I, I wanna feel what some of this patterning feels like. And, you know, I, I know I've tried out the ST DuPont pen and they have it covered in so much lacquer. It's smooth, it's optically has a lot of texture, but to the touch, it's extremely smooth. But, you know, I kind of, there's something kind of like really satisfying about feeling this patterning but it, it's a gorgeous pen let's take a look at that nib so the one thing that surprised me when i removed the cap to check out this pen at first was how small the nib is because compared to my other Le bon pens you know this is like a number five nib and my other Le bon pens have number six nibs so i was kind of surprised at how small this nib was but the good thing about Le Bon too, I mean, yeah, I mean, you know, is it, does the size, 
Does it really matter? Or is it just about how you use it? I'm just saying, you know? My Le Bon nibs write great. I've got three of their pens now. This will be number four. And let's just see how it works, you know, before we pass judgment here, okay? It does have a metal grip section, but I, I like the way it looks. I like the two-tone nib. I think that's really cool. Seems like a lot of the Le Bon pens have that two-tone nib. Now, does it come with a converter? Oh, you see that O-ring? O-ring, yeah. So if anything happens inside of this barrel, your cartridge, your converter get loose, it inks everywhere. Hopefully this will prevent any gross accidents, yeah. Yes, yes. I love converters, especially when they come with the pen. So yeah, there's your converter. It says Le Bon on it. Very cool. Now, yeah, being that this pen is an all metal pen, you know, it's really not super heavy. It's actually quite light. Let's post this cap and it posts like a champ. Look at that, dude, that's gorgeous. It feels, it feels really good in my hand. I love that. This is a beautiful, this is a great pen. And you know, it doesn't just come, this is, this color is called Ruby Red. It also comes in sapphire blue. So if you're more of a blue person, yeah. I actually have the, here's the um, catalog page from uh, Farney's. As you can see here. So it has blue and red. And you see I underlined some of the important points of this pen. There it is. I guess the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ink this pen up. And let's see how she writes. So yeah, according to this Farney's catalog entry, it says Le Bon 986 Galoche. Pure elegance and superb value. You know what? I believe that. I do. This is a great pen. It's good looking. And you know what? It wrote as I expected it to. The Le Bon nibs, I don't know what they're doing to their nibs but they write awesomely. And this pen writes awesomely. It does. Yeah, I like it. It's beautiful. So you can find this at many of your favorite pen retailers, especially online. 
And, uh, you know, check out Penchelli. Check out Farney's has it. You know, check out Farney's. Gold Spot carries a lot of Le Bon pens. And, yeah, I'm going to highly recommend this pen. I really love it. It's, it's beautiful, and it's a great color for fall. Fall is going to be here before you know it. Gosh, where did this year go? Man, it seems like time just like just speeds by. Anyway, so let's talk price. The MSRP for this pen is $240. You know, even the MSRP, it's really not that bad. I think Le Bon provides a great pen with great value. So what are they? Superb. Superb value. I do. So the MSRP is $240, but that doesn't mean that's what your favorite online retailer is going to charge you. So you can actually get this pen for under $200. And over at Farnies, it's as low as $192. And I imagine that's where it's gonna be like at Pen Chalet and Gold Spot. But I don't know if Farnies op offers a coupon code or not, but I know Pen Chalet does, especially if you're a veteran or a teacher, or if you use the coupon code Good Words. That's Roy's coupon code, and that will get you 10% off. Or you go over to Gold Spot and you get this pen, you can get 10% off by using the coupon code Roy. So there you go. So you can get that even lower. So from 192, you can get that down to probably about one. I'm not gonna do the math, man. I am I'm a creative person. I'm not really a math person. So imagine that's like $19.20 from the $192. So you can get that closer to about one, about 172-ish. So you can get it even lower. So I think it's a great price for a great pen. I think Le Bon offers a great selection of pens for reasonable prices. I'm like quickly becoming a huge fan of Le Bon. Honestly, I mean, there's like, I would really love like, you seen these? You seen those pens? This is the Le Bon 325, the Aqua Laguna. Hello. I'd like, I just, I'll take one of each. Thank you very much. Good night. <laughs> all right. Well, that's really all I've got to say about this pen. It's delightful. I love it. So thank you for joining me for this look at the Le Bon, the 986 Geloche fountain pen. And that's how the ink flows.